Now in this question then, we're given this formula. We're told that a diesel lorry is driven from Birmingham to Bury at a steady speed of V kilometres per hour and the total cost of the journey C pounds is given by 1400 over V plus 2V divided by 7. And in the first part of this question then we're asked to find the value of V for which C is a minimum. So how are we going to do this? Well, just basically, not that you're necessarily expected to know this, uh, what the graph looks like, but it might help you appreciate the problem. If you were to sketch this graph of the cost in pounds against the velocity or, or the speed in kilometers per hour V, then what you would get would be a graph looking something like this. All right, so it'll come down like this and then go shooting off like that. And we've got this minimum cost occurring here. And we've got to find out the value of V, this value here, okay, that makes this a minimum. And at this point on the curve, the gradient would be zero. In other words, that is DC by DV, the rate of change of C with respect to V, would be equal to zero. So this is basically how we tackle this problem. We've got to find DC DV, put it equal to zero, and solve the equation for V. Okay, so I'll take you through this, okay, how we do it. Well, first of all, let's get this term here um, in a better form for differentiating. So this is 1400 times 1 over V, and 1 over V is the same as V to the power minus 1. And then for this one, we'll just leave it as 2 sevenths V, 2 sevenths V. So we're now ready to differentiate this. So in the usual way, dc dv, all we do is multiply by minus 1, so it's minus 1400. Take 1 away from the power, so that's v to the minus 2. And for 2 sevenths v, when you differentiate that with respect to v, it's just 2 sevenths. Let's tidy this term up. This becomes minus 1400 times 1 over v squared, which is just going to be that over v squared, and then plus 2 sevenths. Okay, so all we need to say now is therefore when c is a minimum, we'll just say min for short, okay, dc by dv will equal 0. And if that equals 0, then we've got this quantity equals 0. So therefore, minus 1400 over v squared plus 2 sevenths equals 0. And the best way, I think, of solving this is to now multiply through by 7v squared. And if we do that, what we would get would be minus... 9,800, because it would just be timesing that now by 7v squared. The v squared would cancel, so you just get minus 7 times the 1,400, so minus 9,800. And when we come on to this term, and we times through by 7v squared, it's just going to be 2v squared, and that's going to equal 0. Rearranging this, we've got 2v squared equals 9,800 and then if we come down here we can divide both sides by 2 so that means that v squared is equal to 4,900 take the square root to give us v square root of 4,900 what's that going to be? well that's going to be 70 so therefore v equals 70 all right, so that's the value of V that would make that a minimum. All right, okay, so that brings us to the end of this part of the question.